Welcome to another great episode of American Rifleman Television, brought to you by Ruger, rugged, reliable firearms. Now, Ruger really made a splash with the American rifle. It was affordable and accurate. Now, they've built on that platform to make a precision version. Not all AR rifles are chambered in 223 Remington. One of the most interesting is our Rifleman Review, and that's the Stag Arms chambered in 9mm Luger. For I of this old gun, we'll look at the Type 99 rifle chambered in 7.7 .7 and used by the Japanese Imperial Army during World War II. But right now, let's head for the factory floor at Ruger. Well, this week we're in Newport, New Hampshire, and we're at the home of Sturm Ruger and & Company, and we're looking at their latest product. This is the Ruger Precision Rifle. This is a really interesting bolt-action rifle based on the American, but it has multi-magazine capability, and it's designed as a true all-out precision rifle. Over the past few years, we've done a lot of work analyzing what makes a rifle accurate. What factors matter the most? Is it the crown? Is it the bedding? Just what is it that does it? And we've done a lot of, uh, frankly, scientific work. And we felt that we had an opportunity to make an incredibly accurate rifle. And being Ruger, we we're bound and determined to make that a very affordable rifle. And we wanted one not just that it would shoot very accurately at 100 yards, but that if you were fortunate enough to have the ability to shoot longer distances, you could really reach out and, and, and enjoy it. The Ruger Precision Rifle didn't, didn't have a, a formal um, design statement when we, when we first started the project. We were able to build some early concepts and pitch those ideas and then, then get traction for the, for the full-blown project to, to take place. Some of the first concepts that drove it were the, the multi-magazine interface and the AR handguards and stocks being used. That really changed it from a, a standard chassis style design or a, a heavier stock to a brand new platform. So we're going to be shooting today both 115 grain and 75 grain bullets out of this, this same gun. It has a 7.7 .7 inch twist, so it handles those bullets very well. Okay. As, as, as you can see today, it, it uh, shoots those those great too, as well as the the lighter barn bullets here. We've got the 75 grain V Max. Right. So those, those are both 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 working great in, in this in this platform, giving you excellent velocity out of our 26 inch barrel, and overall, it's it's a you know, great package for environment, target, or um, you know, match shooting. To watch this entire episode on Outdoor Channel, contact your TV provider today.